What is up everybody, welcome to this new video. I'm going to be showing you how to make a multilingual page website in so Shopify. It's really, really easy. So let me just still go directly into the actual point. So the very first thing you wanted to do is to make sure that you already have an actual store to make the multilingual language. So what I wanted to do first of all is to try to locate my online store. As you can see, I'm already here into Shopify. I'm going to locate my online store. And here, what I wanted to do is just to make sure that I have an active website. So as you can see, I have this option. I have the down boson i'm going to hit into the pages and i have this landing page created so i'm going to hit into view page and here we go here's our landing page right so this one is parent into english what i want to do is to use all of these elements and create the same actual page but now into another language so what i want to do now is to go back into my shopify store i'm going to hit into settings and i'm going to locate i'm going to scroll all my way down and try to find the actual languages apartment section so as you can see, have this stored languages. What I want to do is to locate the one that says add a language. So as you can see, I have language. And what I want to do is to locate the Spanish. And there we go. It says Spanish is now ready to be translated. So add uh, edit to add Spanish translated to your store, blah, 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 blah. Learn more about translating and localize your store. So what I want to do now is to go into the unpublished language. I'm going to hit into edit, translate and adapt. And as you can see here, all the content, every content that we have just saw into the actual website, everything that appears in here is now appearing here. So what I want to do is to get into, let's say, I'm going to start with the actual product, the collections. We get into the edit and all the elements that we can see here into this translate and adapt. It's going to be like really really easy to get started so i'm gonna hit into next i'm gonna hit into next once again i have the x mark and here i have the title of the collection so instead of choosing let's say for example home page let's translate this into the actual language or you can choose the option in here it says auto translate so i'm gonna hit into translate and there we go so after that what you want to do is to now locate the other elements that you wanted to start editing for example the products for example the online store i'm going to get into my pages and i'm going to go into my landing page of the 30 percent discount so this is the part where i wanted to change everything now into spanish so when that has been now successfully added once i hit the auto translate stuff uh, what I can do is to just go back into my actual website and then make sure that I have I'm gonna hit here I'm gonna go into reload the page down here have the language English I'm gonna change that into Spanish and there we go everything now automatically has now been added into Spanish voila guys it's really 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 easy and fast to do this into another country so uh, go nuts and, and try to add as much language as you can so you can reach more and more audience with that being said we cannot reach into the very end of the video but just in case you have any questions you can leave it down below in the comment section so thank you so much for watching the video guys have lots of fun and i'll see you next time